If you've just joined us, we're pleased to have two-time Grammy winner Brian White on our show. You know, Brian really lays it out there for us. From his struggles growing up with an alcoholic father to becoming a husband and a father himself, it's all reflected in the album Dust Bowl Dreams. And you'll really be encouraged by what Brian has to say. Dust Bowl Dreams, this album, what does it mean to you at where you are in your journey in life now? What did doing this CD help you discover about yourself and what do you want other people to, uh, to get from it? Life makes you a better storyteller. Life seasons you. Um, but I have learned so much in the last 10 years of my life. Um, I've seen a lot, of, a lot of struggles, a lot of personal struggles. Um, uh, being a dad um, has set me on a, a much better course in my life. I look through a totally different lens now. Um, people matter to me more because I'm a dad, because I'm a husband. Understand. And there's just so much inspiration to write about now. But man, when you start uh, really just uh, sort of approaching everything like this and just uh, not trying to chase the dangling carrot has been a real liberating thing for me in the, in the last decade. And this music, I, I got to give credit to my family, my roots. Uh, I finally got to talk about my father and my relationship with him and, um, and his battle with alcoholism. I got to write a song about that that was um, very liberating for me too as well. It's a and powerful I, song. No, oh, thanks. And I, I know I'm not the only kid that no. deals with that. There's millions of people all over the world, but right. wrote a song specifically for my wife. Um, wrote songs that uh, talk about my kids. Uh, uh, you know, I, I really made a record with total freedom and, and I wasn't worried about an, what an exec was thinking about it. It's the heart behind Dust Bowl Dreams that I really want people to see more than, oh, this is a great song. I hope that they see a little bit of who I am and, and what I'm trying to do in my life. Even all that said, the legacy for me is not what I do musically, it's what happens when I walk off that stage. It's, it's what kind of kids am I raising? What kind of a legacy am I leaving as a human being? So I've got a lot of work to do, but I think I'm real sensitive of, of how I'm living my life and, and, and I'm trying to do it right. You're in the right place. <laughs> <laughs> Segue. <Yeah. laughs> Sorry, that was not planned. Night after night when I do this particular song, I, I always send it out to the troops because I, I this is the, to me, this is a, a perfect song for that because it's, it's about love. And to me, uh, I don't, I'm not talking about puppy love. I'm talking about the ultimate love, the love that, that knows no judgment and, uh, and uh, always conquers and never fails. And, and, um, this is uh, probably one of my favorite songs I've ever recorded. So here's The Right Place on The Right Place. When you need to dance, love still feels it when the feeling's gone. Love lives on and on. Wow, wow, wow. Hey, love is the right place to be a while, to be a while to get it straight. Now I wanna stay. And every day of my life I realize That I'm in the right place Love is the right place Love moves in mysterious ways Like a mist on the river At the brick of day So pull up in your shadows Sing a modern song as love moves on and on Wow, wow, hey, 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 hey Love 
was the right place Took me a while, took me a while to get it straight Now I wanna stay And every day of my life I realize That I'm in the right place No, that's the right place Where you are, and there are fire, sun and moon.